What's up, everybody? It's going to be a short one tonight. It's pretty late. Just hanging out here. Tomorrow's Friday. So that's exciting. Um, rearranged the... Um, you know, using those Ikea Calyx today. We bought kind of a, a different design that we were going to use upstairs, but um, but it didn't support as many of those uh, little, sh like, the slidable shelves that you can put in or whatever, the little buckets. And we kind of like those upstairs with the kids' stuff, their toys and their clothes. So we were going to use it upstairs, but we ended up moving it to, like, where the all our game game station stuff is. And it actually kind of worked out. I like I like kind of the layout and, and, and how some of the consoles kind of, some of them fit kind of perfect uh, in that kind of um, different Calyx design. So then we moved what, what was over there um, that were just the standard square buckets upstairs. So that's what we did today. Um, after work at least, what else, what else happened today? Did we go anywhere? I don't think so. Um, just looking ahead, I got still kind of working on that speech a little bit. And then, um, and then we got Jackson's birthday coming up. He's turning five. I cannot believe that I have an almost five-year-old, um, looking to get him a, a bicycle with training wheels. He really wants a Pikachu one, but the, the, the struggle I have is, yeah, we can find some cheap Walmart, you know, $50 bike, but I'd rather spend a little bit more money and get like, you know, there's, there's a couple I found that are like really solid bikes and what can kind of grow with him as he, as you know, and they have really good reviews and all that stuff. I've, I've seen a couple on Amazon, so it's not going to probably be a Pikachu bike, but if you're ever watching this, um, you know, maybe we'll paint it yellow or put Pikachu on it somehow. But because dad wants to just invest a little bit more money and not just get a cheap bike that's going to break and, and actually last you a while. So I'm kind of excited for him to learn. You know, he's actually really good at the balance bike. He'll go down the hill kind of zooming. I mean, I, I, you know, I've had him I've recorded him a few times um, and he'll go down zooming and he can balance and turn and, and everything. But now he just needs to learn how to pedal. Um, and so anyways, and there's a trike. And he's done it a few times, but he's just, like, against pedaling. He, like, didn't... I'm just like, all right, I guess, whatever. Use your balance bike. But eventually, you know, he wants to, like, race people and keep up with the big kids. But he can only really do that going downhill. And then as soon as they turn around and go uphill, he gets left behind. And I'm like, yeah, that's because you need a pedal. <laughs> Anyways, um, so looking forward to that. And then, um, so, yeah, what happened tonight? So... We went out for, we had, you know, we kind of ran some errands late and, you know, we're kind of driving around at, you know, later at night. And usually when we drive around at night, the kids, you know, sometimes we just let the kids fall asleep before we come back home. Um, we used to do it more often, probably more than maybe we should have instead of just putting them to, to sleep uh, in bed. But whatever, you know, we haven't done it in a while, so we figured we'll do it tonight. And so we're driving around and then we got Amelia, who's like, she must be going through a growth spurt or something. She just, she wanted, uh, you know, my wife to hold her hand and she was sort of kind of throwing a fit. And so that was a little bit of a struggle. And I was like, all right, maybe we should just go home. You know, maybe this isn't worth it tonight. Um, after we finished our errands, we we're like, well, maybe we'll just head home. And then, you know, of course, as soon as we get a little bit closer to home, she ends up passing out. And it appeared that Jackson kind of fell asleep on his own. And the, even when we got home, here's Jackson when we get home. He's kind of like this, and he goes, uh, uh, uh. And it's like, like, usually his head bobs forward, and, like, he kind of, like, you know, snaps back up. This guy tricked us so good. I could not believe it. He, you know, my wife was even like, oh, look, he's having a bad dream. What should we do? And I was like, just kind of smack him in the head. He'll wake up, you know, kind of joking. I, you know, I'm not going to smack my kid, but... I say it to get a reaction out of her, and she goes, I'm not going to smack him. And I was like, yeah, I know, I'm just joking. And then all of a sudden, he kind of starts, like, laughing. And like, and she's like, oh, maybe it's his bad dream turned into a good dream. Maybe, you know, like, look, he's kind of laughing in his dream. And then we kind of look at him longer and longer, and we realize he's not sleeping. He's awake. And, and he's like, ah, I tricked you guys. And I, we're like, okay, this kid has a future in espionage or something he got us good he, he's a trickster uh he thought that was pretty funny we started laughing too i 
I don't know, he did a good job. So now, we're, now we have to be extra vigilant if he tries to do that again. Well, I'll, I'll make sure he's actually asleep next time. Anyways, um, that's all I got, guys. Tomorrow's Friday. I'm excited. It feels like it's been a long week. It feels like this week has kind of been dragging by. So it'll be nice just to to get the break on the weekend. Um, we'll probably do some stuff around the house. And then, um, you know what it is. It's uh, Seahawks home opener. So that'll be fun to watch. I'm not going to it. I know some people who are. But, you know, just kind of first home game. It'll be exciting. So... I don't know. I'm 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 cautiously optimistic about kind of some some of the stuff uh, we saw from last week about the Seahawks. Anyways, uh, I keep saying it's gonna be a short one. Uh, it's already been six minutes. I'm cutting it off. Good night, guys. Peace out. Have a good week. Have a good weekend. We'll talk tomorrow.